Hi guys, at Christmas I got my hands on the Facebook portal 10 inch display and I have integrated it with Zoom and my Zoom account for Zoom Rooms. Have a look. Okay guys, so first off we have the uh, unboxing. Here is the portal box and what it looks like followed by uh, the 10 inch screen. It's like a big photo frame for a better word. The power lead and the power lead is quite interesting because the power lead also has the stand that connects to the back of the portal built in so once you plug that in that is your stand and a little manual of how to get connected so when once i plugged it in this is what happened this is the portal logo that comes up it took a while to load up and then you get into your languages you select the language that you want and then connect to your Wi-Fi now of course I'm not going to show you my Wi-Fi password and then give the portal a name so I gave it Justin's office for example and then uh, you agree to the terms of service and it comes up with let's get your portal ready so you I started getting the portal ready um, by clicking continue. Now, when I set up my portal on Christmas Day, it had a load of updates to run. So this took a good 12 minutes or so to, to run the updates. Uh, click next once it's ready to go. You then log in to whether you want to log into your Facebook account, if you have a Facebook account. If you don't have a Facebook account, maybe you just use WhatsApp and you want to use your WhatsApp contacts. I set it up on both of them. I don't have a workplace account. Uh, that's a business Facebook account, I believe, so didn't have to worry about that. Next, you start adding your favorites from either Facebook or WhatsApp. Um, and then how you can connect with people that you regularly call. Uh, the photos is at the top you can load up photos from your facebook account or uh, you can download the portal app to your smartphone and then start adding photos from there that's what i did so personal photos that i don't want to put on facebook or because i don't want other people to see them such as photos of my kids i don't like sharing photos of my kids on social media so i literally just loaded up photos from my phone onto my portal locally and uh, so when i'm not using the portal you can display photos of your children or your favorite holidays or whatever snaps you want into the app store and you have your usual contacts uh, apps spotify was one that i added and um, you can watch the latest videos from facebook story time is a kids uh, animation while you read stories photos the photo booth if you want to take some selfies there a browser a simple browser window settings and gaming i ha uh, haven't used any of the gaming but when i went into apps i actually wanted to download the zoom app because i use zoom quite regularly and it gives you a zoom room interface so went into zoom clicked downloaded zoom and once i opened it it asks you to sign in now i have masked out the code because that's uh, an authenticated code to me but it would give you a six uh, digit reference uh, of numbers and letters you log into zoom.us forward slash pair to link it with your zoom account and it will give you this screen and where you can actually join meetings start meetings use the whiteboard schedule meetings as well um on on the zoom room app so there you have it very straightforward video if you have any questions my details is on the wall behind me please do get in touch with me subscribe to my videos any questions if you find my videos useful you can buy me a virtual coffee really appreciate it until my next video thanks for watching and goodbye